Hi, Logan here with One Shark Games, and today we're working on Twist of Destiny. Twist of Destiny is a 2D turn-based RPG, and it's going to have free roaming towns, and it's going to have a world map with nodes where you can access different points for battle, for towns, and things like that. And um, the point we're at now is developing the town areas. So you can see we have a main adventurer here. He can run. He can run up, down, left, right. It's kind of open. And um, the other thing, his companions will follow him. Right now they all look the same, but there will be different companions, so it will be uh, not clones. So they follow him, and as they start to get too far away, you'll see they switch from a walk to a run. As they get closer, they switch back to walk, and then they stop. And you can see our NPCs here. They'll walk to different waypoints on the map. They'll stop for a different, you know, a random amount of time. And then they'll decide to take off again towards the next point. Uh, another kind of cool thing that we did here is we made so that the players will hog this curve. So although they can free roam in the other areas of the map, here it tightens up. And if you just hold down left, you'll, or if you just hold down left or right, you'll see it hugs the curve as it runs through here. And the NPCs do the same. And you might wonder, well, how do you do that if you let it walk all over the place everywhere else? I'll show you quick. So here we chose to tighten up the colliders. And when you do that, you can see, ignore that. I'm running out of battery. I want to get this done. So um, as you can see, if you hug this curve here, the colliders will push you up and down smoothly. So if you run back and forth, there we go. That's how that works. And the NPC might have a waypoint over here, and as they try to get to it, they'll hug that curve due to those colliders. But there we go. We're going to use that mechanic a little more, too, for things like stairs and other, other kind of uh, obstacles. So this is all still in development, and we're working hard on it. It's not finished, but it's really coming out. It's turning out good, and we're having some fun with it. And here's where you will enter the world map, and you'll pick other battles to go to, and you'll pick other towns to go to, places that you may have not visited yet. You have to battle until you can reach them. And they won't be the only world map. There will be more than one. So the day and night cycle takes effect in here, too. If there's a storm, you'll see the storm happening in the background, the sun and the moon rising. Um, and each new day, there's a possibility for all different kinds of weather. And if you leave the world map, you head back to town. You can see the parallax here, like this clothesline, for instance. Uh, anyways, I'm about out of battery power here, but this is Twisted Destiny. It's going awesome. I'm going to be out for about a week here, so there won't be any new videos during that time. But when I come back, we'll be full force. So thanks for watching the video. Thanks for following along with us. We really appreciate all the support on our past games and future games. So um, subscribe, follow along, let us know any ideas you have, and they might make it in the game. Thanks.